Welcome to Minnesota Sports Talk. I'm Josh Cohen. I'm Carter Burquest. Today we're talking about the Minnesota Timberwolves getting the number one overall Woo! pick. Confetti. Pop it. <laughs> there, there it is. Yeah. Work. For the fifth time in the history of the state that one of our teams have picked number one. We're just so excited we can't even handle we it. We are going to have three number one overall picks on our team. From the best team in the NBA. The rookie of the year and the number one pick will be on the same team next season. Yep. If you want to start playing the parade route, go ahead and do it. Now that we know for sure it's a number one pick, who should Truly. we take? Now it gets fun because we get to debate Okafor or Towns over and over. If we have the number yep. two pick, this conversation goes, who do you take? And then you say whoever's left, yeah. and that's it. So here we get to actually debate. Um, I would take Towns, first of all. Um, I think you might probably agree with me there. Yeah. Uh, more versatile on the defensive end. Has some long-range shooting ability, um, more athletic, can do a little bit more than Okafor can. I think he fits the mold of the Timberwolves more, but I don't know. What do you think? Yeah, I'm all on board with the Carl Anthony Towns. Yeah, uh, Okafor looked like the runaway consensus number one For a early time. in the year, and yeah, yeah. although most way through the season, and then in the tournament when he went up against other big guys, other seven footers, or he got double teamed, or just. Um, you know, better defensive players in general. Yeah, he he struggled a little bit in the tournament. He Towns did. looked better in the tournament, yep. and that makes me think: one, okay, is he if he struggles against the couple seven footers he faces How's he in college? Do NBA everybody in the NBA has got a seven footer, so that would make me want Towns. Obviously, the versatility, yep. uh, the defense. He's got a little more in shooting. Can actually hit free throws. Yep. Flip is gonna. He loves kinda, the two way he, players. He's gonna kind of. Yeah, he does, and that's why I think he's going to go there. Yep. I think he's going to kind of milk this as long as he can because people are talking about the Timberwolves, yep. and that's a good thing. But I think at the end of the day, he loves the two-way players. Uh, he said that you know Okafor is a really good post-offensive well, player. Best since Tim Duncan. Since Tim Duncan, offensive big man. But Flip doesn't like a slow-down half-court kind no. of offense. Who's he been br bringing in the last couple of years? Athletic Athletes players. that can run the floor. Uh, play multiple multiple positions, two-way players. Yep. That's the kind of guy he wants. That's what Carl Anthony Towns is. Okafor is not. I think, too, to go along with that is is we have a guy in Kevin Garnett here for one year, probably, maybe, maybe two years, but one year, and a guy that fits way after the Kevin Garnett mold is Towns, to sit yeah. behind Garnett and, and learn from one of the greatest ever yeah. here. So pick a guy that can learn more from him than where and Okafor kind of plays a completely different game than, than Garnett. Yeah, did. he can, you know, Garnett can try to teach him some defense, but at the end of the day, he's not doesn't have the length and athleticism yeah. that Garnett has, and but Towns does. Championships, here we the come. The Wolves are Best a core team in the NBA. we reckon with. A championship core. We have yep. the guys to win a title. Not next Agreed. year. Don't think we're crazy. Don't get carried away. But we have the core. These the guys core can develop, develop together, yep. uh, and we can win a title. So for the first time... In franchise history, we got the number one pick. Yep. We've fallen back. I looked this up eight times. We've gotten a worse pick than we should have, including... By the, the way, the lottery is rigged. We still agree. Yeah, it is. They just threw us a bone because they felt bad for us. Including 92 and 2011, we were supposed to have the top. We had the worst records. 92 was Shaq. when Shaq came out. We got Christian Leitner instead because we got screwed in the draft. And 2011. But this all makes up for it. Was we took Derek Williams. Yeah, Adam Rubio. Silver's got her back. So. Levine, Wiggins, Towns, and Gorgie taking us Let's to go. the title. Let's go. Minnesota, here we go. Sounds like championship to me. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next time.